and a jamboree on me and my friends tonight. That is so true, Reggie. You know, Reggie and I were just talking that animals are just like us. They're just like people. They're curious, they like to have fun, and, and they love riding other animals. Um, <laughs> This is Animals Riding Animals. Now, this, this game couldn't be simpler. I'll show you an animal, and then you tell me which animal that animal is riding. Now, who wants to play, huh? Hi, what's your name? Emily. Hi, Emily. Why don't you turn around here that everybody can see you. Where, where are you from, Emily? Oregon. You're from Oregon. Where in yeah. Oregon? Eugene. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. My, uh, my father's name is Eugene. <laughs> I guess it's not funny. It's just kind of coincidental. <laughs> and, and what do you do in Oregon? Uh, I'm a student at the University of Oregon. Oh, yeah. The, you're a duck. Yeah. yeah. A duck. <laughs> That's good. So. If you're already a duck, you should have no problem at all <laughs> with this contest, don't you think? Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna show you an animal and then you take a look at that animal and then tell me what animal it, this animal is riding on. Of course, that's very clear. I'm not confusing at all, am I? <laughs> all right, now take a look at this animal right now. Take a look at this one. Okay, that's obviously a... Dog. Very good, very good. <laughs> so far, so good on that. Now, you need to know what you're playing for, though. If you get this right, you will be the proud winner of a weekend getaway to Safari Land Indoor Amusement Park in Villa Park, Illinois. <laughs> That's right. Huge, huge prize. Flights, accommodations, all are not included. <laughs> Meals are also not included, and, and they don't allow food into the park, so you gotta eat before you come in. Anyway, you know what I'm saying. Now, tickets are non-transferable, and they'll expire a week from today, right? <laughs> so you should know that if they go unused, there is a $45 cancellation fee per ticket. <laughs> so you really don't wanna do that, so you better use them or else it's gonna cost you anyway. Anyway, the stakes couldn't be higher, am I right? Okay, yeah. Okay, now, are you ready to guess what animal is that animal riding? Yeah. A uh, yeah. The animal, it's riding a yeah. Let's, oh, no, oh that's not it? Uh, a cow. A cow. The dog is riding a cow. Seems like we're in a children's book, isn't it? All right, let's see what animal the dog is riding. Oh, you're right. It is a cow. Fantastic. Oh, look at that. Oh, yo, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I mean, you don't get those. You're a fine duck, though. You are a fine, fine duck. Please have a seat. Thank you very much. Let's go again. Let's find someone else. Let's find someone else. Who else will be? Who else will be? Come on up here. Come on. All right, now, come on. Come on. Come on. You come on up here. We ain't gonna go guy, girl, guy, girl. That's a bit. What's your name? Albert. Albert. Yeah. That, that's my father's name. <laughs> that's so. That's so strange. That's good. Where are you from, Albert? Uh, Fontana, Fontana, California. Fontana, go. And what, what do you do out there, Albert? General manager of Papa John's. Woo! Papa John's! <laughs> Not only that, Albert brought free pizza for everyone tonight. <laughs> free pizza. You didn't bring the pizza? No. Oh. <laughs> Papa John's not gonna be happy. <laughs> okay, now you know how this game is played. You know what the stakes are. Yes. You could go to the Safari Land <laughs> Indoor Amusement Park in Villa Park, Illinois. So there's pressure. Do you feel the pressure, Albert? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Okay, now just try to relax. Try to think clearly. We're gonna show you an animal and you tell us what animal that animal is riding on. Let's okay. first see the animal, there it is. What, do you know what that animal is? That, that, that's a frog. It's a frog, <laughs> okay, very good. It's got its eyes on you. The frog, <laughs> now we have to find out what animal would a frog be riding? Be very careful. Okay. Albert, take your time because this is for the whole thing. This is for going to the indoor <laughs> amusement park <laughs> in Villa Park. <laughs> Do you have a girlfriend? Oh. Yes, yes. She would love to go to the indoor <laughs> amusement park in, in Villa Park, Illinois, don't you think? Yes. 
Uh, again, you have to pay for all flights and accommodation. <laughs> that's, that's standard on this show. But uh, so, you feel the pressure, you feel the tension. What is your answer? What animal is the frog riding on? I'm gonna go with a pig. Ooh. <laughs> a pig. Good answer. Good answer. I, I don't know why that's a good answer, but that's what they always say. Oh, good answer. Good answer. Like, not really. Okay, but, but it could be. It's a crazy question, right? All right, let's see what the frog is riding on. What animal? This is very rare. This is a very rare, t okay. Very rare tower of power. This is a tower of power. What a treat. This is exceedingly rare, ladies and gentlemen. Now, there are two frogs, as you see on this. Now, they're actually part of a tower of power. Your job is to tell me how many frogs are in the photo riding on frogs. So, in other words, how many frogs make up a tower of power? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Remember, indoor park, villa, <laughs> and, and don't. We'll go. You, you know, you are actually, you're sweating a little bit. May no, I? I'm nervous. I know. May I do this just to, <laughs> okay, let me just do that just a little bit. Are you feel better? Yes. Okay. Now, your answer is how many frogs are in this photo riding other frogs? Six. His answer is six. Audience, what do you think? Four, four, five. Good answer. Good. Let's see how many frogs make a tower of power. Five. Oh, oh, it's so close. I'd love to give you that, but I can't. <laughs> Albert, thank you very much. Thank you, thank, you. thank you very much. Thank you very much. Who else would like to play? Come on, let it, come on over here, we'll play. Hi. Hi, what's your name? Matilde. I don't know why I'm yelling. <laughs> your name is Matilda. Yeah, Matilde. Matilde. Yeah, exactly. Where are you from, Matilde? Italy, Rome. I Italy, Rome. <laughs> oh, bene, bene, molto bene. Molto bene, molto bene. Molto bene. Anything you said in Italian, it could be curse words, and yeah. we would all go, oh. <laughs> right? It's a beautiful language. Are you here on vacation? Uh, no, actually, I study here. I can tell by your American accent <laughs> that, you, that you've been here quite a long time. Uh, no, for four months. For four months. And yeah. where in Italy are you from again? Rome. You're from Rome? Yeah. Oh, my God. My father and mother, <laughs> they met in Rome. Yeah. And then they had me, and I don't know where they are now. But, <laughs> Anyway, are you ready to play? Yeah. You know the game. Yeah. You know how tough it is because we had I really want to go there. You, oh, I know, kidding. <laughs> I know. I mean, if, if anybody from a foreign country wants to see what America is really like, <laughs> it is the Safari Land Indoor Amusement Park in Villa Park, Illinois. I mean, that is the place. Yeah. Forget Disneyland. Forget that. <laughs> it's this. Okay, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, here we go. Matilda, we will show you. There's our animal. Okay. Now, that is an American bald eagle. I don't know if you would have known that or not. Oh, oh my goodness. We have another. Oh, this is great. We have a switcheroo in Clark. The old switcheroo. Now, what that means. Okay. What that means is that. Okay. Okay. So. so okay. So what that means <laughs> is that we switched it up. Now this is animal is actually being ridden by another animal. Okay, so okay. something is riding the bald eagle. Okay. What animal is riding the bald eagle? Now remember, again, if you really want to see America, <laughs> you've got to go to the Safari Land Indoor Amusement Park in Villa Park, Illinois. And of course, once again, everything, flights, accommodations, meals are not included. And that's very American, by the way. I need to win. I need to win. Yeah, it is weird. I know. Um... Okay, what is your answer? What is riding on top of that bald eagle? I think a monkey. I th a monkey? 
How much would I pay to see a monkey on top of a bald eagle? That is a great answer. I love that answer. All right, let's take a look at the bald eagle. What's riding the bald eagle? Oh, it's a crow. It's a crow. It's an ordinary common crow. How disappointing. Yeah. And I'm sorry I can't give this to you, but um, thank you for playing. And uh, thank you. Buena sera. Thank you. Thank you very much. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen. That is animals riding other animals. Stick with us. This is the ladies.